Hi, it's Steve. Today we'd like to show you how to change the lid switch on your washer, and it's a really easy job. All we're going to need is a number two Phillips screwdriver and a 5 16 nut driver. Let me show you how we do it. Now the first step in this repair will be to disconnect the power. So we'll simply pull the plug, and we'll want to pull the washer far enough forward that we can access two Phillips screws that are in the bottom corners of the console. So we'll loosen both of those screws completely. Then we'll just give that console a little bump forward and tilt the whole console backwards. And disconnect the wire harness to the lid switch. Just lift up on that locking tab, pull it away. And then we'll remove the 5 16 hex head crown screw. And then just raise the lid about halfway, depress that latch, and then remove the lid switch. Now to install the new one, again we'll raise that lid, slide that down into the opening. And we'll want to make sure that that tab engages the slot at the back. We're going to lower the lid. Reattach that ground screw. Reattach the wire harness. Make sure the locking tab engages. We can then roll the control panel back into position. And there will be either two or three hooks on either end cap that will engage slotted openings in the top. So we'll line those up. Just give the console a little tap backwards until it lines up flush across the back. And then tighten up the Phillips screws. We're now ready to reconnect the power and our repair is complete.